Greetings ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to yes another review from the Trek Collector and this time it's the Battlestar Galactica the official ship's collection modern Cylon Raider. Yes this is the second in the line of the Battlestar Galactica uh, official ship's collection that Eagle Moss or Hero Collector are doing. Now this will set you back a total of 44 euro and 99 cent 44 pound 99 pence or 59 dollars and 95 cent and you can get this off the eagle moss website or you can go looking on ebay if you want but i would go with the eagle moss website so here's the graphics on the side i really like this packaging guys it is nice crisp uh lovely logo in there nice view of the ship there as she sits on her stand same as the other side and then we'll look at the underside of the ship and we'll flip her over to the front of the box. Now let's have a look inside and see what we get. So, as always, we get a magazine, which we'll quickly look through. Just before I do that, what I'm gonna do is, just we'll take a look behind. Well packaged, again. And look at the size of this, guys. That is fantastic, great size. I do think there's better value in this collection than there is on the XL Starship collection. You're looking at around 10 euro cheaper which is great and um, we'll look at the ship now in a second but before i do that we're just going to have a quick little look at the magazine so nice again the red the logo at the back clear lovely picture of the ship issue number two really really nice i'm not going to go into too much on the magazine guys just to flick through just to show you kind of know what you get you just get more than just the model you get information on your Lovely Cylon Raider. Uh, lovely artwork. Some moments through the show. Little bits and pieces there. Starbuck vandalizing the bottom of a Cylon Raider. And you know what? You, that was a great episode. I actually like that. And I'm wondering, has this collection brought anyone back to watching Battlestar Galactic? But the biggest question I'm going to ask is, what did you guys prefer? Did you prefer the modern ships or the original ships? Um, this one did grow on me. But as the series went on, I have to say, I really, really liked the Raider. Uh, in the modern Battlestar Galactica and we can see some concept artwork which I love and you can kind of see some resemblance to the the old Raider so how you know they modernized it but you know trying to stay true to, to the original which is is fairly fairly cool it's nice to kind of see the thought put into a modern series with you know kind of some of the original looks now I know the Cylon Raider looks completely different from the Cylon Raider in the TV show, but we did actually get to see the the old Cylon Raiders throughout the show. So I wonder will Eagle must be giving us the modern Raider and the old school Raider, but that's the back of the book. So without going on too much, let's have a look at the ship. Look at this. Now this is 25 centimeters long. One tip I'm gonna say, when you're taking out your packaging, take it out by the wings and do not take it out by the centerpiece. This seems a little bit fragile, very easy to come apart. Um, it's okay, but just be very aware that that piece is very fragile. Now we've got metal all here. Plastic. And the whole underside is plastic. Okay, and the guns are plastic. Yep, and the thrusters at the back are all plastic. So let's get in close and let's... Guys, the paintwork on this is amazing. Um, absolutely spot on. Do I have a little bit of a green spudge here? Oh well, a little bit of green spudge. You know what? Overall, <laughs> this is just, <laughs> you know, I'm blown away by the size of these things. Um, the detail on the thrusters there for the engines, you know, that they're fired looks absolutely brilliant. Um, the whole weathering effect is beautiful on this uh, they've really actually done such a great job on the ship and this is the second one in the collection so they've done this and um, they've done the the viper first and if you haven't checked out that review please check it out one thing that i do notice which is wrong is we've got a constant big red and um, which should be more vertical but that's a little unfortunate but overall this is absolutely one fantastic model nice bit of weight in it but there is a good bit of plastic in it as well so 
I'm going to put her on her stand and we'll take a look at it on the stand. So here is this bad boy on the stand. And you know what? That is absolutely fantastic. Definitely one beautiful, beautiful model. I am becoming a huge fan of this collection. I really hope this does well. One thing I will say, what I'm disappointed is that there is no UK subscription, which is very poor. I really think this is really, really and truly a beautiful model. Uh, also, uh, Eagle Moss, the UK website has changed over to DPD um, and you can get like a two day delivery service. And in fairness, I know my friends in the UK got this on Monday and I also, I live in the Republic of Ireland, and I also got this on Monday, which, you know, is fairly, fairly good. So I'm glad kind of like on the UK side that Eagle Moss are going kind of fairly cool with a uh, delivery service. So I have to say hats off uh, very, very quick. Galactica is up for pre-order now. On the site but the big question i'm going to ask which do you prefer guys do you prefer the modern or the classic ships what do you prefer um otherwise than that what more can i say but like this is just absolutely fantastic if you haven't please subscribe to the channel hit the subscribe button hit the like button hit that bell icon for notifications of any reviews that my channel does do i also do star trek starships in case you want to check them out but that is it from me so say we all till next time.